Hey everybody, this is Gary, the fist pump guy over here at Bondi's Toyota Enterprise, Alabama. Today I'm gonna bring you something different, something I haven't done before. Today I'm gonna bring you a product review. This one on these LED headlights from JDM A-Star that I put and installed on my 2017 Tundra. So stay tuned to find out if you indeed want to go with LED lights from JDM A-Star. Stay tuned. I got, I'm supposed to have a special package in the mail today and I will explain a little bit more about it uh, as I go, but let's go check and see if it's in here real quick. Be right back with you. Let's see if I do indeed have a package in here. Well, there's one in here. Let's see who it's for. Yep, it's addressed to me here at the dealership from JDM A-Star. Hmm. Let's go see what it is. Thank you for joining me for this product review video. Now, JDM A-Star reached out to the fist pump guy. I appreciate it, guys and asked me to review some of their product. And they do LED lights uh, primarily. I don't know exactly what all they do. And I'm not the most technological person. All I knew that is if somebody reached out to me wanting to review a product, I was gonna give it my best. So obviously when I searched out to do this, I said, let's do it on my 17 Tundra because it has halogen lights. I'm not too fond of them. So I wanted to figure out what I would do a review on. So here's the headlights. Uh, the LED headlights from JDMA Star, they're eighth gen, okay? And I decided what I would do the review on is how quick I got them, uh, the packaging, how well they were shipped, because obviously these are very uh, fragile parts, how well they were shipped. I'll show you a quick video on that to let you see what I thought about it. All right, so we're sitting here today. I'm going to start unpacking this, uh, these lights and install them in my truck, but I wanted to go a little bit over the pa packaging on it. Um, these are the JDM a-Star LED headlights for my 2017 Tundra. My plan is to take one of them and try to install it, see how, see how quick you can install these, uh, see how much effort it takes, because I'm not the most um, mechanically inclined person, and see and try to compare those lights. But I want to look at the packaging first. I will say this box is nice. It's a, it's a nice solid box. Um, I will say that it, it may have you know had something heavy on it where it may have got crushed a little bit, but let's see what the contents look like on the inside because this box is pretty solid as you open it up it looks like it's pretty clean in here uh, nice styrofoam surrounding the surrounding the light so uh, doesn't look like they could shift much or come out of the box too too easily um, packaging looks solid um, I, I see that everything in here is nice and tight so if you did have to ship something like this or get it in the mail you don't have to worry about it shifting and getting damaged so uh, what we're going to do is we're going to start the installation process today my plan is to do one, uh, see how well it uh, installs, see how easy it is to install for somebody like myself, and compare it to the lights that's already on it, and eventually compare it to the lights that's on some of the 2018 Tundras with LEDs. Stay tuned, let's get some of these installed. The next thing I thought I would do is a video on how easy they were to install. Now on this particular project, I thought that I could probably do it myself, and I probably could have, but I wasn't familiar enough with the uh, front end of the Toyota. So I got my lead tech, my shop foreman, John Bottoms involved, and we figured out that you have to actually take the headlights out, which includes taking off the front grille, taking out the headlight assembly, disconnecting it, and then installing the new lights. So we found out that it was pretty easy to actually install these lights. Um, I must be I must say I must be uh, I'm impressed it took about 25 minutes total install that's including taking the grills taking the side pieces off of the headlights uh, we did make some adjustments on these uh, the only thing that we did different is we used the factory rubber grommets that come on the other headlights they work perfectly with these JDM a star lights um, and they fit perfectly so we didn't have to worry about any fit issues there and then we used double-sided tape in order to mount the little box so it's not just hanging and dangling everywhere uh, onto the side of the vehicle. So it made it a lot cleaner, very quick, nice assembly. I'd have to give it an A plus for um, how easy it is to install these lights. The next thing I figured I would do is I would compare these LED lights versus my halogen lights. So I did a road test. Obviously the, the, uh, the first one I did was on the halogen lights. I, I turned them on turn them on bright going down a dark road to kind of see what my visibility would be like as you can see here um, the the halogen headlights are a little bit uh, dim um, when you really look at them especially when you compare them to the LED lights and then I did a video on the LED lights from JDM A-Star 
to see what my visibility would like be like. So you can see that they're very bright. They light up the road real nice. You get a great vision on both sides, even on brights. See the stop signs, see the road signs, everything very easily, very nice look on these lights. Then I decided what I would do is compare these LED lights from JDMA Star to the ones that are on the 2019 Toyota Tundra off-road limiteds and stuff that you can get. And I wanted to do a side-by-side -side comparison even though it was somewhat still daylight to see how bright they were. And obviously on the left-hand side you can see the JDMA Star LED lights versus on the right the 2019 stock LED headlights. And then the JDMA Stars do appear to be quite a bit brighter um, as far as the look goes. So overall, Overall, I would have to say that these lights are uh, quite impressive. Um, I did get a take from uh, uh, my lead mechanic, John Bottoms, of what he thought, and here's what he said. So, uh, John, in your professional opinion, how easy were these to install? They're about an intermediate level. It took about 35, 40 minutes, but I've done a few of them. Sure. Um, average person may take an hour, hour and a half, but it, it's pretty straightforward. Okay. So overall, I'd have to give this product A plus overall. I really uh, like the fact that they reached out to me because this actually um, helps me get involved in something else in my career. And I do appreciate you guys for reaching out to me. But reach out, JDMA Star, uh, LED lights. If you're looking for a good headlight, my, my lead mechanic told me yesterday that he's going to buy some of those for his Tacoma. And uh, uh, because he saw how easy they were to install, how great they looked, even in the daylight. So uh, if you're looking for a great light, I do recommend JDMA Star for your LED lights. Now I didn't try any other lights, but it would be nice to put LED fog lights on my truck too because when you have the LED lights on and the regular fog lights on, it doesn't look good. So I hope this helps somebody. Message me, comment, Gary at thefistpumpguy.com if you have any questions. Thank you for joining. Follow the Fist Pumped Enterprise.